The question is this. Do you believe there is other intelligent life in the universe? Are you talking about aliens? UFOs and little green men? No, no. That's all popular hysteria. I doubt any of it has any basis in fact. I'm talking about the hidden history of our planet. The very origins of human civilization. Ancient powers that modern science, even at its pinnacle, could barely begin to comprehend. You think aliens created human civilization? Of course he does. Shouldn't everyone? I mean, how do you know they aren't? Oh, this is gonna be good. Guess they kinda dropped the ball on that one. Well, maybe they should come back. Give it another shot. Wonder what they'd think to see us now. Aliens? Don't make me laugh. Do not listen to this absurd nonsense. This is plain daft, is what it is. Exactly what I was gonna ask. Strong not care. Smash aliens! That's really interesting. Look, I know I talk a lot of crap, but this alien stuff kind of freaks me out. Yeah, just to let you know, if he invites us to join his super fun cult, I'm bugging out. Stranger things have turned out to be true. Interesting's a word for it. You're not buying this hooey. This is all just smoke and mirrors and fictional nonsense. I thought you had a head on those shoulders. I put my trust in the scientific method, not the pseudo-spirituality. You're fallen for this bullshit. Quite so. Interesting being the key word. Another chem addict. Let's not feed his delusion. I guess it could be true. It's boring! Human too much talking. You can believe whatever wacko theories you want, as long as I get paid. Look, d don't make fun of this stuff. You never know. Let's just nod our heads and smile to the crazy person. And judging from the look of this place, you can foot the bill. As enlightening as this has all been. We will be getting paid, right? This is a complete waste of time. None of what he's saying exists. I heartily agree. If there's a load of caps involved, I'll believe anything you say. Such flattery will get you nowhere, sir. I'm not sure any amount of caps is worth this, but we should get something at least. There's no need to be rude. Why humans like caps too much? I don't understand what this has to do with anything. Yeah, what's the job? It'll help me take my mind off all the alien crap this guy's talking about. Yeah, what exactly is it that needs doing? So if we could just, uh, skip to it? Not that this hasn't been scintillating. I tire of Monsieur Cabot's nonsense. Right. The job. Interesting idea, though. One job for fighting! Edward Deegan sent me. I'm looking for a missing package. Oh. You're the new guy. So this package... Pretty sure we know where it is. The guys that shot Ben are holed up in the Parsons Creamery. Just north of here. So you've just been waiting for me to show up to do something about those assholes? Screw them. Let's just do the job. Yeah, who does that? Oh, wait, everyone does that. It's likely for the best. Wouldn't want her getting hurt, now would we? What, you wanted to wipe your mouth for you after meals, too? Guess we're not all lucky enough to have loudmouth partners to watch our backs, are we? Perhaps they're unqualified to handle the situation. We are supposed to be working together, no? A bunch of lazy blokes. That's what you are. That surprises you? Come on, General. A little tack wouldn't hurt. Now we do something. We kill them. Lucky for you, I'm not afraid of a few raiders. Are you kidding? Raiders are a joke. You're not. You've seen raiders, right? We're mouthy guards. And lucky for all of us, we'll be leaving shortly. Unfortunately, it seems like you don't know when to drop a subject. That would be highly unlikely. Doesn't anyone have manners anymore? Or anything for that matter. Sir, she's just doing her job. I don't believe you've anything to prove here. I hope not. We wanted her help, remember? 
Bah, puny human raiders. That's true. Edward wouldn't have hired me if he thought you could have done the job. Couldn't have said that better myself. I think we just got off her Christmas card list. And Edward's clearly improved his eye for talent. Don't know when to quit, do ya? Just dig us deeper. There's no call for flippancy, soldier. Is there any reason to provoke this lady? Oh, I like it when you get cheeky, love. Sir, truly, your demeanor is second to none. Maybe I should do the talking next time. Human weak. Sorry, I shouldn't have said that. There's no reason to apologize. They should be glad we were here. Yeah, don't get your knickers in a twist. We meant no offense. Just running our mouths before a fight. My friend here gets a little excitable sometimes, just before a fight. Mouth runs faster than the brain on this model sometimes. It doesn't matter. It's over now. So now all is well. Oh, come on. Don't apologize to her. Please accept his apology, Mum. You don't owe anyone an apology. That wasn't so hard, was it? <sighs> Strong never says sorry. Who are these guys? Raiders? Sure. Assholes with guns. I guess we know our next stop. We're the ones helping her. Sheesh. Time for the professionals to take over. Now, if you'll excuse us, we've got a package to recover. Well, we have our next target. It is appreciated. They could have just said that in the first place. Yeah, thanks. Now we fight. Kill humans! That's all I needed to know. Come on, we got a job to finish. Time to clean him up. Let's not keep the boys waiting. Let's move out. Come on, let's go. Ready when you are. Thanks for pointing us in the right direction. Time to fight. Time to kill. Why, hello. Did you like the song? I love the song. It was perfect. She's one of the reasons why this is such a great place to lie low. Angelic as usual, Mags. Ah, there ain't nothing like real jazz. Real great set this evening, ma'am. Of songs, that is, I... Oh, is it warm in here? I think the song wasn't the only thing you were enjoying. Strong prefers sound of battle. I'm not a big fan of jazz. Jazz is all right, but nothing beats good old-fashioned rock and roll. Me neither, but a polka, on the other hand. Then you clearly ain't listened to enough of Mag's work, friend. No accounting for taste, I guess. I'm more of a country western and bluegrass fan myself. Yes. Sound of battle much better. I'm looking for Emma Jean Cabot. Oh, I'm sorry, but Emma Jean is indisposed right now. She's not seeing visitors. I just need to make sure she's okay. You've got my word. She's fine. She's just staying in her room right now. Not that it's any of your business, but she and I are just having a little relationship trouble. You know how it is. <laughs> She's not seeing anybody until she cools off. Maybe 500 caps will help make her available? Oh, what a waste of good caps. And a good fight. Moves like that will keep both of us alive a lot longer. You sure? I really think his getup could use a splash of red. You could buy a lot of funny outfits with that kind of scratch, pal. Five hundred caps? Huh. I'm in the wrong business. Bribing instead of fighting. That's a new one on me, soldier. If this is what it takes to avoid the bloodshed, <sighs> Why the hell are you paying this idiot off? Sir, I dare say you could have gotten away with less. One bullet would have cost far less. Better a few caps than getting a bunch of misguided people killed. Why pay? Just smash! I'm a friend of the family. Maybe I can talk some sense into her. 
Blah, blah, blah. Why are you even talking to these morons? Yeah, we go way back. You know, from the party about the thing. Oh, the stories we could tell. Oh, yeah. We can be real convincing. A few words with the lady and we'll be out of your hair. Please, have a heart. I highly suggest you let us speak to her. Please, surely you will let us just talk? Oh, come on. These idiots aren't going to listen to reason. Please, sir, it would only be a moment. You'd really better let us see her. Yes, friends. I'm going to see her, one way or another. Your choice. Maybe they'd rather spend the last few seconds of their lives with a gaping hole in their chest. So that's our play? Got it. You wouldn't want to get any stains all over that fine outfit you're wearing, would you? You really think that's the best way to play this? Whoa. You really want to head down this route? One way or another, we're going to see her. You should know that we are, regrettably, quite skilled in the use of violence. We could always start by ripping your damn arms off. Sir, was that really necessary? It would be more efficient just to kill him. I can't see any reason why he wouldn't let us see her. Unless he was actually holding her prisoner. Strong smash this one now? You're Jack's sister? I was expecting someone a bit... younger. You really know how to flatter a lady, don't you? Just to be clear, I'm Jack's younger sister, the baby of the family. Once I get home and get some of Jack's serum, I'll be back to my usual stunning self. Jack has a serum that reverses aging? It's more like it halts aging. I started taking it when I was 32, so normally that's what I look like. You'll see once I get my treatment. I was well known as one of the bells of Boston society, back when there was any. I have a vial of that serum with me. Here, looks like you need it. Oh, come on. After all we went through, you're just giving it away? Eternal life is overrated. Just ask any ghoul. You don't think there might be some folks that could benefit more from that than Grandma here? I guess she'd benefit from it as much as anyone. Bottoms up. Don't give that away. We need to pass it on to our Brotherhood scribes for study. And you're giving it away? Think of the tremendous opportunity for study. What are you doing? That's worth a fortune. Such a kind gesture, sir. That could have been valuable to the Bioscience Division. Since it wasn't yours in the first place, that seems appropriate. Human share. Good. Humans help humans. I think you were about to agree to helping me kill Jack and the rest of my traitorous kin, yes? Sounds good to me. This was a bad idea. You should have left that guy in there. Why the hell did you let him go? Sir, do you really think that was wise? After all Jack told us about him? I don't think that was a very good idea. Strong not fool. Strong is strong! <laughs>